Hello, Mark. Hey, Harry. We're just coming into the wharf, and we've got some beautiful pilchards, mackerel, trevally. You'll have to be able to have a pick of what you want. Uh, you're a legend. I'll be there in about half an hour. Okie dokie. Thanks, buddy. That first phone call at 5 a.m., when you, you know what you've got coming through the door, you know it's just been caught, you know it's fresh. That really sets you up. The brain starts ticking, you can't go back to sleep. You just want to get in the kitchen and use what you've caught that day. You know, it's very cliche to say, uh, use what's in season, but actually getting the produce when it's at its best, like there's nothing better. So when we moved to East Gippsland, we knew the produce was amazing. Um, but as we actually started to meet the producers and, and the suppliers and learn their story and the, the passion they have for the produce, it, it was just a wow moment. And uh, whether it's the eggs or the honey, all these uh, tiny little ingredients that play such a big part of our restaurant. And it's right on your doorstep. So we've sort of followed the produce to its home and it's life changing. Often restaurants try and storytell through food. For us, the story is about the amazing producers, and I'm, I'm proud as a chef to be able to cook with these amazing ingredients and put it on a plate. My journey as a chef, I've always liked to live near the water, I've always enjoyed being outdoors. It really does pay a massive importance in the way I think about menus and the style of the dishes. And, and I think I learned that by the chefs I worked for in Europe. They were very, very honest, traditional, and I just like to put a little creative edge to it. I mean, the whole of Gippsland, and especially East Gippsland, is, is such a vast, vast block of land. Uh, but one of the most important things is the lake system. Um, we're right on the water. It's amazing. When I was working in the UK, we'd go out and pick wild mushrooms every morning, every afternoon. And it was only moving to Gippsland that, you know, you, you take the dog for a walk and all of a sudden you remember the mushrooms are there and you see them and it brings back so many memories. You remember dishes and you remember experiences in previous kitchens and restaurants and it really helps you drive what you're doing. It's me telling my story of where I've come from and things that I've found. I'm Mark Briggs, I'm the chef of Sardine in Painesville, East Gippsland.